Ingrid Deutsch was presented at Doctor of Laws, the first woman to be awarded this by Macquarie University. So I teach at the School of Law. I'm a teacher already. And uh, I did my research on access to justice for women who have been raped. And uh, the research highlights and makes proposals for some changes that can be made to enable women who have been victims of rape to achieve justice. A Dutch is among the hundreds that graduated from Macquarie University today. To some, these are first PhDs and degrees in their family. It's a great achievement for us as a family because we have never got a PhD in our family. This is the first one and it is a great honor. The law degree is supposed to be four years. COVID, I think, is the biggest challenge. We ended up doing five years and then we were online. However, for some of us would like to go back and go for masters in specific areas that we are passionate about. We need to diversify as uh, graduates. We need to understand that, you know, the job market is very tight. And President Chori Museveni, who attended the event online, emphasized the need to invest more in sciences as they are the base for economic progression. That's why Africa was colonized. It was not that we were cowards, it was not that we were not clever, it is that science was not emphasized. What was emphasized were these other uh, actors. And this is the mistake I don't want us to, to, to repeat. He has advised researchers to avoid collaborative research. Collaborative research with whom and why? that they were doing collaborative research with Oxford and all those people. Why do you collaborate with others? Why don't you do yourself? The Vice Chancellor at Macquarie University, Professor Barnabas Nawangwe, has asked government to sponsor PhD and master's studies for students in critical disciplines and create a loan scheme for studies in other disciplines. We must train these masters and PhDs if we are to solve the problem of shortage of human resource at Uganda's more than 100 universities and the other tertiary institutions. He said that Macquarie continues to lose many vibrant researchers to other universities because of the matter of salary enhancements. Europe and other developed economies have established so-called science visas through which they are luring our scientists. Meanwhile, there are students who completed their studies but were not on the graduation list. According to Professor Nawangwe, some of them submitted the required documents let. Nobat at Kunda NTV.